Hi, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a mega menu using Elementor for free. So if you have a WordPress website and you want to create a mega menu where you can display your menu items, images, videos, forts, galleries and so on, you can do it easily by watching this video. And by the way, I already have a few videos about mega menu, but some of those plugins are there, elements are now paired. So I decided to make a new video to show you how you can create a mega menu for free. And this is the menu that we will be creating in this video. As you can see, we have a top header, then logo, and this is our mega menu. As you can see, our latest articles here. These are the menu items with headings. And we also have tabs here. We can display icon boxes like this. We can display media like product types, videos, galleries. This is a full width, so we can display an image or a video with title and button. And also contact info like this, contact form and map. And you can also add any elements that is available in the Elementor. And this is another version as you can see a vertical one. We can have something like this. And this is the third demo. And we can also make off canvas menu like this. So let's see how we can create these one by one and for this we will use this website as you can see this is an e-commerce website with Wolfis and here you can see that I have some product categories this is a long list so I want to display these in a proper way and uh, for this I need a mega menu so let's create a mega menu the first thing is let's go to our Wolfis dashboard and the first thing you will need is Elementor obviously so you can install its free version link will be also in the description and then you can go to the second link in the description which will take you to this page. This is a royal add-ons page where you can download this plugin for free. And you can also upgrade to its pro version if you want. But you will need the free version to create a menu. So once you download this plugin you can just upload this to your WordPress repository. For that you can go to your dashboard. Here you can go to plugins, click add new. Then click upload plugin. And select the file that you downloaded and click install now. And after installation, this will take you to this page where you can just skip this. And then this will take you to its template library. And uh, then you can go to Royal Add-ons. And here you will see all the widgets that you can use, all the extensions, which are these. And you can do some settings for this plugin. So let's go to widgets. And here we will search for Mega Menu. And here you can see Mega Menu. So make sure you turn this on in order to use this. And now to enable Mega Menu in any of these items, you will just need to go to your Wolfis menus. For that you can go to Appearance, Menus. And this is our main menu. As you can see we have these product categories here. So now I want to enable Mega Menu on this item. When I hover mouse over here, you can see Mega Menu. By the way, this will not work on the sub item as you can see, I am not seeing that option. This will work only in the parent menu. So in order to make a mega menu, just click on this mega menu. Then you can enable this. You can choose the drop down position, the drop down width, which we will see later. But for now, let's edit this with Elementor. And this will open up Elementor page builder, where you can design the menu the way you want. You can also use some of their ready-made templates. If I click this, there are a number of templates that are available that we can use. Like, I need a menu, so I can click on this. I can use any of these headers. I have showed you this in my previous video and the theme builder video, where we created header, footer, blog post, product page using this plugin for free. So, let's close this. We need to create a menu, so for that I need a structure first, let's click on this and I need a 4 column layout, so I'll click this. Now I can display my product categories or items here. So let's see this, so I have these categories, first I'll create a heading with this title, baby and ties. So let's drag a heading, I'll call this baby and ties 
let's choose h5 and now i can list my categories here so for that i can use a menu so i can create a menu for that or i can create a list which is a normal list from elementor and then i can write my category title and its link let me show you how so i'll copy this baby care and its link so we'll copy its link and instead of this i'll write baby care we'll paste the link you can display the icon or you can just remove this this is our first item you can also design this by the way you can change its style its color typography icon and so on and then i have another one so let's copy the link we'll duplicate this and we will call this baby safety and we'll change its link now let me just copy this to make the video short you can display your more items here then i can copy this title you can paste it here and let's display an image or products here so products and now let's search for products and you will see o grid slider and carousel this is also free by this plugin so let's drag this and as you can see we got our products with all the categories but we don't need this let's hide the filter so we'll go to layout and uh, instead of this we will use list style so now we have a list let's decrease the number of columns to one like this we will hide the filter which is this also we will hide the pagination we only want to display a few products here so let's go to query and let's re let's display only three products and then we can go to its elements and we only want to display the title so we will remove the status category rating price and add to cut now we only have these titles now these titles are very long so let's display only two products and let's go to its style and we will change the title typography to decrease its size to something like 16 or 15 Now this is now these are our two products. Let's go to content and go to layout. This is the distance, so we will decrease this. And that's it. Now these are our two products. Let's copy the title. We'll paste it here and let's display something like uh, a video now obviously you can display the items that you need but i'm just showing you the possibilities so let's search for a video and this is our video now again we will paste the title here and let's display a gallery or for contact we will display map let's drag this map here let's reduce the height and that's it now we have display menu items, products, video and contact info but you can display anything you want. Let's update this for now and now if I refresh this I can't see that menu and this is because this is a normal menu by this theme but we will have to create a menu using this plugin. So let me show you how we can create that quickly. So let's go to our dashboard and let's go to Riley Adams and theme builder where we can create a header and now we are under header we can create a template let's call this custom header we'll add a condition for this so let's display this on the entire website and we'll save condition and now to quickly create a header let's use the ready made template so i'll click this and we'll choose a category of name menu and all of these are available for free so let's use this one 
and we got a hello so instead of this button we will use a logo this will be our website logo so i'll select my logo and we don't want to display this so let's just hide this let's remove the button also now we got our logo and this is a menu so and this is our main menu so let's remove this and i'll add search box there we can design this later and let's design this quickly so for that let's edit this to quickly change its background color and i'll change these info later on and that's it this is our menu now let me quickly update this and now let's visit our website in a new tab so this is our header now and we just need to enable the mega menu on this one and here instead of this menu we will use our mega menu so let's search for mega and this is mega menu by royal add-ons so let's drag this and we will select our main menu here and let's remove this one let's align this to center and we will design this later on but let's update this and let's check our website now and this is our mega menu as you can see we have the menu items products video and a map now we can design this we can change the width so we can decide the width and the menu so we will go to menus we will edit this and this is the drop down width so we can change this to full width and save save menu and let's check again we have our menu items, products, video, contact and so on. And that's it. Now we have a full width mega menu. And let's go back to menu. And let's try custom width. So you can give it a custom width up to something like 700 or 800. Save menu. And let's refresh this. Now the width is just 800 pixel. So this was how you can create a mega menu using Elementor for free. Obviously you can design your menu the way you want it. I just showed you the procedure. I hope you have learned something new in this video. Still if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.